I carry my car because my mom always says, make sure you got money when you go out. Say you thinking you're just going to go for a run, but then say someone walks by and they're selling water ice. You really want to miss out on that? Say you go into the mall and say, girl, I'm not spending nothing, and then your car break down, and then you need to pay the, the tire company or whatever, and they take card. But you don't have your card, neither do you have cash. So now you're sitting there like, hmm? see you in the bathroom and somebody's in there selling weave do you really want to knock in your bundles okay that's what i thought wow. 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 Oh. welcome back girl hold on <laughs> i know a lot of y'all never see me without nails and to be honest, I've never seen myself without nails. So this is a huge adjustment for me. It's something that I don't really want to talk about because it kind of hits home. And it, it's just like mm, a, like a hard topic for me to grasp. So I'm not really going to get into that. <laughs> but if you are not a local baby yet, I can see your lace. It's lifting. Please leg it down. There's, there's, you're struggling. <laughs> So today, ah, my lace is lifting too. Don't even worry about it. But I'm going to do a what's in my purse. <laughs> I never even thought that I thought about doing this video a while ago, but I showed you what's in my book bag. So I kind of thought like, oh, like they already know what I carry around. And I showed you what's in my emergency kit. And I'm like, y'all know, but like, I might as well. People like these videos, right? Y'all like, y'all like these videos, right? I think mm, you do. You do. No, you do. So let's go. My parents got this for me for Christmas from Nordstrom's. It's such a cute little bag. Oh, Bloom Bloomingdale's, but it's sold out now, so don't even think about it. <laughs> but I told you where it's from, so if they restock, you know where to get it from. It's from Bloomingdale's. It was like $40, y'all. And look, it go like, hold on. You open it like that. This don't seem like it's stuck. Wait. You know what? I'm not even going to worry about it right now. All right, so you open it like this. You pull the one both sides, oop, and you open it. Wait. Yeah. I guess it's only one side you pull. Whatever. So, this is what's in my side bag. I'm finna just show y'all what's in here. So, first, I have my lash glue. Because, say I'm on a date or, like, it starts raining or I start crying because something's funny. I'm sad. Someone tickled me. Something like that. And the, when you cry, like... Okay, I know I tell you that weave glue is, like, really strong, but sometimes it's inevitably going to lift. So, sometimes, like, the side of my... Oh, shoot, why is it so bright? The side of my lash will lift. So, I'm like, oh, my God, that's, like, a, a nightmare to be out and about and your lash lifts. <laughs> that's not only embarrassing, but it is also... It's just sad. <laughs> So I just always have this around because if it starts to lift, I go to the bathroom. I hold on, roll, do 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 do, put it on, okay. And you can't forget the tweezers. How are you gonna put on your lashes without tweezers? I don't know how some of y'all sit there and put on lashes with your hands, but you are going to hell in a hand basket with a ten-piece nugget from McDonald's with no sauce, because that's what you get. You get no sauce. So anyway, child, I'm not even gonna acknowledge y'all crazies out there, but. You know, to put on lashes, you need a, a tweezers. So, you don't have, I got my tweezers and my lashes. That's all I need, okay? So, it's just it's always handy. And I only carry small bags. I don't like the totes. So, it fits, okay? Next. Let me make sure I don't show y'all the number by accident. All right, so next I... Oh, oh my God, my name. Okay. Wait, y'all know my name. Y'all know it's Gabrielle, right? Okay. I have my card. I'm, I don't even know why I'm showing y'all. Like, I might as well just put it down. I carry my card because my mom always says, make sure you got money when you go out. Like, you don't know what's going to happen to you. Like, say you thinking you're just going to go for a run. But then say someone walks by and they're selling water ice. You really want to miss out on that? And they take card? Mm, baby. Say you're like, you think you're just going to walk the dog. But you see somebody selling lashes. And they take card. So now you're missing out on the opportunity. Say you go into the mall and say, girl, I'm not spending nothing. And then your car break down. And then you need to pay the, the tire company or whatever. And they take card. 
but you don't have your card, neither do you have cash. So now you're sitting there like, hmm? So always have your card on you, no matter if you're just going to the bathroom. Because see you in the bathroom and somebody's in there selling weave. Do you really want to knock in your bundles? Okay, that's what I thought. See? See, it's always handy to have these things with you. And this is very beneficial, everything I'm going to tell you. So make sure you pack your bags after this video or during this video. Do it with me. Next, I got my, let's see what I have to cover up on here. You know what? Next, I got my driver's license. You can see my face. Yeah, I looked chunky. I looked like a potato. You don't have to tell me. I know. Like, it's fine. Like, I know. So, it's not like, oh, Gabby, you look like a, a um chunky, like, little potato. I know. It's cool. We know. And I thought I was so cute that day, too. The guy was like, smile. I was like, I'm going to look like, I'm going to look like I don't, I'm not phased by this. So, I was like, I thought I looked like this. But then, this is how I really looked. Who does that? You know, it's fine. No, really, it's fine. <laughs> Next, I have a mirror. Oh, wow, I forgot I don't have any nails. <laughs> Thought it was going to make a sound. All right. My boyfriend got this for me from the Nick store. And KOP, I live in Philly, guys. And KOP, they have a Nick's store. A lot of y'all aren't familiar with Nick's stores. Y'all might buy Nick's from CVS. But I'm bougie, so I have a store. <laughs> so, open it up. And boom. Oh, shoot, that's kind of dirty. Hold on. Boom. Oh, this hurt your eyes. Ah, that hurt your eyes. Okay, look, look. Um, you know, say like your lash, you want to look. Do -do 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 -do. Or you want to see if your lace is lifting. Ooh, it is. And now what? You can't do nothing about it. But you will know your lace is lifting, but you can't do nothing about it. Unless you have a big bag and you can bring like your mousse. But I have a small bag and I don't, I don't do that. So, do -do 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 -do. and then you just like do your lip gloss. Hmm. Next, um, this is just my ID holder. My dad's a police officer. He got us the little holder. It's really cute. He gave my boyfriend one too, and my sister, my mom, and it's cute. And it says, "Officer's daughter." I think it's so precious. And I have my insurance card in here. Oh, insurance card. Okay, okay. Look, look, look. So say you out. And you fall, you trip, you break your ankle. We, we, you on the way to the um, the hospital, and they like, okay, you're you gotta pay six hundred dollars for your cast. They're like, oh no, no, ma'am, I got insurance. And you gotta pull it out, and it's not there. And so now you owe six hundred dollars. But if you always have your insurance card with you, you will owe one dollar. So it just it's it's just so beneficial to have that with you. If you are a child, your mother or father or guardian should be carrying that for you. But if you are over eighteen, baby, you need to carry your insurance card. And on college campuses, they take insurance at the nurse's office. I'm always in there, always. I always have a stomachache. I always got something wrong with me. At this point, I just feel like I love going to the doctors. I think I just love the hospital. But yeah, I'd be like, oh, da da, and show them the card, and they'd be like, okay, bet one dollar. So. Next, I do keep my birth control with me. Um, if you are not comfortable with talking about a birth control, please skip ahead. I don't want to make you feel uncomfortable. Whatever. Um, don't feel uncomfortable. It's a pill. You know what it is. It's not nothing to feel uncomfortable with. If you do, that's a problem. We need to talk. DM me. We can talk about it and we can, we can get over your fear of birth control. But anyway, I carry birth control around because um oh okay i take my birth control pill this keep getting all bright every day at 9 p.m so say i'm out on a date and it's nine. Ooh, baby i'm not having a child so i take it like just like say you gotta see you end up sleeping over a friend's house i don't know like, spontaneously don't you want to have your pills with you say you catch up the flight and your flight gonna be home at four but it got a layover and it, it got it got canceled and something happened, and you don't get home till 1 in the morning. You missed your time. So you just always should keep your pills on you no matter what. Like, say your car break down, you went in the woods, and it's 9. Now what? You're, you got to have a baby. So, we don't want children right now. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Some of us do. I know I do not. All right. Next, I have my college ID. Because, say, 
I'm on campus and I get locked out. I need my ID. This is how I get in the building and this is also just how I identify myself on campus. Like, a driver's license is not going to help you on a college campus. You need a, you need an ID. But now that we are not in school, I sometimes, if, okay. If I don't feel like having my, my real ID with me, I might just pop in this in my bag. Because you just always want to be identified. If you fall and you pass out and a stranger walks up and says, Oh, who's that? John Doe. And looks at your car and says, Oh, no, it's Gabrielle. You want to always have ID on you. Say the police cannot identify you. Now they know it's Gabrielle. That's kind of scary. But it's really true. And it's important. Next, I do have some hand sanitizer. I'm trying to focus this. Come on. Come on. This is in the, sh the, the, the scent. Peach Bellini. Mmm, that smells good. Honestly, I never really was a hand sanitizer carrier. But once this whole... I can't say it. Because I will get demonetized and your sis needs her coin. <laughs> once this whole went down... I kind of got a little paranoid because my mom is going crazy and she's like literally making me feel like I'm everything thing I touch is dirty and that's true but now that she's feeling that way I'm feeling that way because she's like ah! and so I just now I put hand sanitizer on every second of the day this one is full because I ran through the other 21 bottles as long as want so that's just what it is. We know we're in a time of dirtiness right now. So we just got to be clean and aware of our surroundings. I only have a few more things, y'all. Don't worry about it. So first, I mean, next, I have my brown lip liner. Um, I don't know if y'all know, but you can surely see um, that I do line my lips with a black liner. And once you eat or drink anything, it's gone. Your lips are back to regular color. So I just have to go do 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 right over it again. So I just always had this because that is my look. That is my look. If my lips do not have a black liner on it, I might as well have no lips at this point. Like I might as well just, you know, have no mm, lips because I love my lips. Have this on it, and if it doesn't, there's no point of lips. Like what else? Like what else is that for? Then, okay, before you put on any lip gloss, you need to moisturize your lips. You can't have dry, flaky lips under gloss. That's not a good combination. So I always make sure I have a Blistex for a base. And then last but not least, your girl has lip gloss. And no, this is not my regular lip gloss. I just, this is the first one I found and I was like, oh, I'll use it in a video. But this is from the Black Hair Store. Mm, not Sally's, not Target, Black Hair Store asian owned black boys so do, 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 you know how to use a gloss um this one smells very funny but it's fine so i hope you guys enjoyed what's in my purse all this stuff is right there or whatever um and i wonder if you guys thought this what was in there i mean i wonder if you guys ever y'all probably don't care about me it's fine but thanks for watching and if you have not yet subscribed after watching this whole duration of this video something is not clicking what's not clicking okay okay bye guys i'll see you guys in my next video okay